Hello, this is HK Training Center. In this time, let's learn about Common Cut. Let's learn what is Common Cut, pros and cons of Common Cut and how to apply. First, let's see Common Cut video. As shown in video, it means attach and cut parts with same length. However, Common Cut is not attaching part completely. Cutting parts while nesting with gap is being width to cut two or more parts together. The common cut has many pros. First, nesting efficiency will rise. Because nesting parts with common cut can nest parts with more density rather than normal nesting. Second, advantage of time due to decrease piercing. A common cut is one of special cutting which also has cons. Not only causing dimensional error but also increases edge collision possibility. It is recommended to nest parts like these examples that facing same side each other. Attach several parts or attach several parts in a row like now. But here are examples that come in cut not allowed for sawtooth shapes such as grid or curves. Then let's find out how to apply common cut. There are two ways to apply common cut. Between two parts, that attaches only two parts. And between several parts, that attaches several parts together. In between two parts, cutting common line first and turn around, or cutting part with each shape direction. In between several parts, Cutting all common lines and cut around. Or cut one part with U direction. First, let's see nesting settings. You need to make setting before common cut. Click configure, system which is above of nesting and machining screen. Go to System tab and select Common Cutting Parameter. Select between two parts or between several parts in Common Cut. I'll choose between two parts first. Then you must select between two parts in nesting for Common Cut on the middle of screen to match each other. Select between two parts and if selected no, Common Cut cannot be done. Next only between same length elements means sharing only sides with same length will be shared but if not checked different length can also be shared when sharing different length will cause more head collision so to recommend using with that function checked only place on nesting direction is when using auto nest after common cut it will be applied by direction of auto nest Besides, there are more settings available such as applying system compensation, cam curve, how to deal with common islands. After select between two parts, click two parts as if they overlap to nest parts with sharing two. It is useful when using common cut in middle or thick plate. I'll show them to you. Next, let's find out how to make common cut. 
to make machining for common cut. Click Contours in Machining tab. Click Common Cut Between Two Parts. Select Right One in Execution Mode, which is used a lot in laser. Now, click Common Cut Line after machining is active. If left side of Common Cut Line selected, Common Cut will start from left otherwise. It will start from right side. User can set direction of start even up and down side are shared. Because it will start close from click point. Go on to common cut between several parts. To use this, go to configure system. Select common cut between several parts in common cut parameter in system tab. Select same in nesting for common cut. In case of common cut between several parts, it is preliminary cut, which means cut more before start cutting next part, due to avoid head collision. With this, machine will cut part like you cut. When using common cut between several parts, sharing one row at a time is recommended, and do not share too many parts. If you want to make spacing like normal nesting, Click Common Cut Nesting next to Collision in Home tab to turn on. Off. Let's find out how to make machining when sharing several parts. Use Parts or Set of Selected Parts and drag parts to cut part like you shape. One by one. At this time, both side of common cut line will be cut before next part is preliminary cut length. Next part will be cut from preliminary cut point without piercing. If no need to use preliminary cut, input preliminary cut zero. The next part cutting will start from common cut line. But be careful because this will cause edge collision. Next is common cut of a grid. This is most used when using common cut for several parts together. One of them is linear common cut of a grid, which is cut all common cut lines first and cut around to finish. In there, set priority of horizontal or vertical common cut. Move red dot position to set starting point of horizontal and vertical. If cut and zigzag checked, think it is cut in one direction. For example, if this row cut left to right, second row will cut same. Otherwise, if this row cut left to right, second row will cut right to left continuously. The outside also can set start point to desired position, if position in center. Cutting around will start from end of less common cut line. That cause one less piercing, Click icon on the right to set lead in. Now I'll show you common cut of a grid. Cutting will start common cut line and cuts outside around. I'll also show two types of common cut of a grid from common cut nesting between several parts. Now let's practice together with program.
Until now, you've learned common cut and how to apply it. The common cut is special cut with many pros, but also many risks. So please use it wisely by choosing right way. Thank you.